Wyatt Thompson, Miles Long here, ringside with you, WLW home video exclusive, glad to be here with you, it's Mike Seidel, the Yoga Monster, taking on Dave DeLorean, one half of the Black Hand Warriors, former WLW Tag Team Champion. Now Mike Seidel, like you said, he's a yoga monster, a guy that, that is, is very unorthodox and is very different, but that necessarily is not a bad thing, Dave DeLorean, that, that is exactly <laughs> correct. Unique and in a good, good way. But a great, as you can see, great physical condition, very flexible. Obviously, believes in the whole yoga movement that's out there in the world and society today. And it's actually, I guess, we're having a uh, yoga off or something like that. You know, quite possibly. You know, <laughs> Mike Seidel is, is, a, is a top Ring of Honor prospect and, and has traveled the, traveled the world. He has been in Japan. He has wrestled for Dragon Gate Pro Wrestling and lived in the dojo for three months. Maybe that's where he picked some of these maneuvers up. Maybe that's where he picked some of these stretching <laughs> abilities up there with Japan. Possibly so. But that's not, that's not to take yeah. anything away from Dave DeLorean. He is a former WLW Tag Team Champion multiple times over. That's right. And DeLorean there moments ago said, I don't want to do the yoga thing, the yoga movement. So maybe we'll just get down to business and wrestle here right here, right now as part of this WLW home video exclusive. Glad to have you with us, wrestling fans, wherever you are. Mike Sardell and Dave DeLorean. Dave said, you know, he's actually having a, he's asking different things for fans. He's just taking his time here. I think it's, I think it's a, playing some mind games. You know, Sardell's very energetic, uh, quick pace. He wants to go fast. DeLorean wants to slow it down and have his pace. And is he saying, am I, is he saying here, maybe a shake of hands, another show of sportsmanship like, right? That's exactly right. You know, we've seen that multiple times tonight. Dave DeLorean. Offering his hand in this. Whoa! Oh, oh God! We see, <laughs> we see Dorian, like you just said, Brian Thompson. He, he got caught in the act. Now Mike Sadell was smarter than the average bear, That's so to speak. <laughs> and the cookie jar, he got him. <laughs> nice side headlock, cinching in now. Mike Sadell in tremendous condition, as you can tell. Doesn't miss too many sessions in the gym. Doesn't miss too many yoga sessions, obviously. And it shows right there. He looks that flexibility a lot. Slide in, keep the side headlock tied in there. I'm, I'm very impressed here, Miles. You know, he, he's doing a, a great wrestling uh, uh, style because obviously Mike Sardell is outweighed by Dave DeLorean. There's no Whoa. doubt about that. But he is just trying to keep everything grounded because if Dave DeLorean were to catch him, yes. then now we see some dirty tactics that the Black End Warriors have been used to doing, have been seen doing, trying to pull the hair. Yeah. And now DeLorean is, has, has Mike Sardell in a, in a head system. Yes, 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 he does. Big legs right there, Dave DeLorean. He's in, he's in good shape, too. Don't let him death to be there at all. It's Mike Seidel, though, right back on it. That flexibility again coming into play. Moments ago, we saw Seidel use the ropes to his advantage, kick off and maintain the side headlock. And he's back to it now. Oh, he's toughing on the man's feet. Whatever works. He just wants to make sure that uh, my, uh, Mike Seidel doesn't get advantage going his way. He wants to keep him grounded. He wants to keep him on the mat and hurt him. Dave DeLorean is a vicious individual. And we see some, uh, some top athleticism. Whoa! Mike Seidel flipping Dave DeLorean down into the mat in a pin attempt. Dave DeLorean still expressing in this match. Sure. Kicking out at the one count. Mike Seidel now back to the left arm and shoulder. Going to try to wear it down. Wear the bigger of the two men down. Dave DeLorean back up to the corner. Or maybe he's talking some trash in there. Could be. He's saying some oh! Ball. Right in the throat. Good gosh. You know, all, the, all the athleticism, all the... All the oh, that is man. a nasty chop from Dave DeLorean. All the athleticism, all the stretching that Mike Sodell can do is not going to really help him out a lot if he cannot breathe, which is exactly what Dave DeLorean is trying to do. He's trying to knock the wind out of Mike Sodell. Right in the wind pipe with those chops, vicious knife-edge chop blows right there, courtesy one half of the Black Hand Warriors. Now he takes advantage of Mike Sodell. Oh, a big drop oh. kick. Well executed. Very beautiful drop kick right there from Sidell going for cover. One, two. Two count only says referee Richard White. Richard White trains here at the Harley Race Wrestling Academy. He gets the top tier in training in one of the best schools, not only in the country, not only in the Midwest, yeah. but you're exactly right, Ryan right. Thompson, in, in the, the world. See what if you say you're trained through this academy, that automatically oh. gives you a leg up. But Speaking of a leg. leg. <laughs> Mike Sardell gave a, 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 a very 
awesome looking leg drop to Dave DeLorean. Got some great elevation behind it. Again, shows that flexibility. Yeah. He's going back to his roots of yoga. You know, it's, it's, it's not only about the physicality and your flexibility, it's a, it's a mind type of thing. It's in your mind, it's your psyche, how you feel about yourself, your confidence. And obviously, it has worked well for Mike Sidell. I don't know if that's a smart move by Seidel, trying to get some forearm shots to the chest of Dave DeLorean. Not to take anything away from Seidel, but DeLorean outweighs him by a good 50, 60 pounds. Oh, you mean uh, all of that? That doesn't matter how big you are. Thumb in the eye, hard work every time. And it did right there on Seidel, DeLorean. And the thing that just upsets me, Miles, is the fact that a guy like DeLorean does not have to break the rules at all. He's a great competitor, has proven he's a multi-time WLW tag team champion. The guy can get it done in the ring, doesn't have to resort to such tactics. That's exactly right. He is a multi-time World League Wrestling Tag Team Champion. And, and he being, you know, rocking, you know, Mike Sardell is a rock and roll wrestler. He's being rocking and rolling <laughs> by Mike Sardell. He's thinking airborne right now. He may do it. Oh! oh! There goes Sardell. He was going for a high-risk maneuver, and obviously, with the high-risk maneuver, there is a high risk, yeah. and that's the chance you take in his crash and burn. Yeah, it did not pay off right there, and now this could be a monumental moment in this contest. A, a, a part where the tide shifts oh. for the better, at least for Dave DeLorean, who is now taking advantage of using the ring as a weapon, that apron that's unforgiving on the back. And now it's fight! Oh, all oh, the folks! One of the... One of the Support post of the whole building, Dave DeLorean is using it as a weapon, and that's clearly against the rules. Referee Richard White telling him he cannot do that. He needs to abide by the rules. He also needs to get Mike Sundell in the ring. And a little bit of referee discretion. They're going to let these guys go at it. Doesn't want to end on a technicality there. But they do at this point certainly need to get this matchup back in the ring where it belongs. Speaking of technicalities, I wonder why there is a water bottle on the corner of the ring, Brian Thompson. That is something that it could be used as a foreign object, but for all we know, it, I know it's a hot night inside this building. Mike Sandell is showing that he's still hot. He has a lot of fire left in him. What's, going, what's Dave DeLorean going to try to do to keep the man down? Looks like he's going to do whatever it takes. We've seen a thumb in the eye, a thrust to the throat. Man will break rules, bend rules, shatter rules, whatever it takes. But again, doesn't need to do so. As you see right here, very impressive. He's got something dangerous in mind right now. Oh, that is about 240, 250 pounds landing straight on the face on the upper chest of Mike Sardell coming down. Oh, that was almost a three count. That, that would have knocked the wind out of me and definitely pinned me for sure. Yeah, I tell you what, I thought it was over right there. Mike Sardell somehow, you know, the wind is his head just ricocheted off those turnbuckles. It looked like he had had some sort of a whiplash, like a car crash, and sit still at a stop sign. Somebody nails you at 60 miles an hour coming behind you. Oh! oh. That's a headache. That, that, that is a headache waiting to happen for sure. He might need to go back. He might need to go to the hospital after this, not only after receiving that whiplash effect that you talked about, but right. again, smacked in the nose, smacked straight in the face, maybe a broken nose. Who knows? Dave DeLorean is just taking this man apart. Yeah, he'll definitely need to go through some yoga session following this contest with his draw. This Magnuson has just been really violent through this out throughout this entire contest. Brian Thompson, I hate to, to, to interrupt you, but that's Dave DeLorean, not Michael Magnuson. I'd get him backwards, man. I'm lying. Both of them are very talented. They're very easy to get confused, but there's one thing going on right now, and that's Dave DeLorean. He's getting you know, some shots delivered by Mike Sardell. Oh, uh, I apologize. Yes, Dave DeLorean is Michael Magnus has a big matchup later on that you'll see on this home video exclusive. Got my mind on that as well. Stay tuned for that. It's a very delivered now by Dave DeLorean to Mike Sardell. One, two. Mike Sardell still showing that he has a lot of energy. He has a lot of fire left in this guy's body. Oh, he just crushed whatever life was left in him right there, Miles. One, two. Referee Richard White, the referee assigned to this contest, saying no, it's only a two count. And Brian, I have to ask you, how much more does Mike Sardell have left in, have left in the tank? And I tell you what, I don't know. I'm, I'm questioning it right now. Is DeLorean scooping a slam? So vicious right now. He thinks it's all over. Oh, he's calling for something. He's thinking high risk here. Look at him pointing toward the, the turnbuckle area. Maybe he's going to hit one of those moonsaults you don't really see a whole lot of. Oh! Oh! Oh, man! And that's why you don't see a whole lot of moonsaults from Dave DeLorean. Yeah, he is very agile. He's athletic. He's a great wrestler. But sometimes you just don't hit what you intend to hit. And that's exactly what happened. 
to Dave Delora. Right there, the, the difference in size to quickness worked out for Mike Seidel, was able to move out of the way. DeLorean still coming at the man. Leap frog. Oh, oh, oh. that will stop anybody from a straight kick to the stomach. Yeah, right there, take the wind right out of you. DeLorean thinking dangerous again. Oh, oh. Mike Seidel oh. kicks the legs out from underneath them. You know, it's dangerous up there. You talked about it. It's high risk. Oh. That'll crack your back. That'll right there. shivers down your spine. Yes, it will. I tell you what, both men are spent at this point of the contest. It's been just rapid fire back and forth. DeLorean in control, and Seidel will make, a, make some kind of comeback. But at this point in time, both men are hurt. Who's going to have the advantage? It looks like Seidel trying to suck in now, Miles. Get that second win. Like Seidel climbing the rope, using every ounce of energy to pull himself up. Dave DeLorean now catches a forearm from Seidel and a big clothesline, but that's not enough to take DeLorean down. Oh, wow. I don't know if I've ever seen that insiguri. Dave DeLorean, he goes to the outside after that insiguri. That is what I call true and total flexibility right there. Work to the advantage of the yoga monster, Mike Seidel, who's going, oh, oh. Ah, there he goes. He, sends his, he uses his own body as a weapon, goes between the top and the middle rope, and takes Dave DeLorean out of the competition. He hopes for the remainder of this match. That is called putting your entire body on the line with hopes of being victorious. What a matchup this is, Miles. Mike Seidel may not be doing the smartest thing. He could have left Dave DeLorean out and received the take out, which would have left him with the win. It certainly would, but you know what? I think Seidel is the type of guy that wants to get done, center ring, one, two, three, or submission. That's yeah. very commendable, Brian, yes. very commendable. Yes, it is. Here we go. Oh, big, big springboard maneuver to Dave DeLorean from Seidel. He's got to turn the man over, hook that leg. One, one two, two, oh! oh. Just a few minutes ago, Brian, we saw Seidel, we saw Mike Seidel showing that he still had a lot of energy. He still had a lot of fight left in him. And that's now the opposite way as we see Dave DeLorean show that he still wants to win this match. And he still has a lot of energy and a lot of fire, a lot of passion to keep going because he wants to get the win. So who's going to win? Who do you think is going to win? All right, so it's too close to call for Mike. Like he's right here. Look at this. Nice trip up there. A series of maneuvers now. All Seidel. Oh, oh, man. Nice moonsaw. That was one very, very well delivered moonsaw. Oh. Referee Richard White showing just a two count. The look on the face of Mike Seidel says it all. The, the sheer shock. What's it going to take? How am I going to beat Dave DeLorean here on this home video exclusive World League Wrestling? Race Wrestling Arena, Troy, Missouri. This is a place where it happens. Everything's on the line. Seidel getting the fans behind him. He's yeah, thinking how there is. Yeah, Brian, that might, he's doing exactly that, but he might be wasting time. He needs to stay on right. top of him. Oh. The guy as big as DeLorean, but Mike Seidel is still, still the smarter of the two. Oh, oh no. That kick to the side of the head. Suzuki rang the bell of Seidel. DeLorean. Oh, devastating. That, that would end anybody's match. That's, that, I think that's it. That is, One, yeah. two. Oh, no. No, no way. Somehow, some way, Mike Seidel reached deep down inside, got everything he needed to somehow kick out of that. I thought it was that. That I thought it was over. Me I was too. To tell you, your winner, Dave DeLorean, bottom line. I don't know. Mike Seidel, he is showing that he still has, he might just be a shade above E, but he still has a lot of, uh, some gas left in the tank, enough to kick out, and that's exactly what happened. He used every bit of it right there. Now trying to deliver a oh. super kick, but it's DeLorean who connects. Oh! oh. Suplex with his head landing directly on the knee, the leg of DeLorean. One, no, two. Nate, was that oh it? Oh my gosh, Dave DeLorean has got oh. to be wondering, how much more do I have to do to defeat Mike Seidel? I know I certainly would be. DeLorean now looking around. Now he's saying, okay, that's it. Yeah, I think he's done playing with Seidel. I think he is going to end this match right here and right now. He realizes it, it may be now or never. He's going to get the job done. He better come up with something high impact. He's thinking about it. Seidel trying to fight out of this. Whoa. Oh, and a big hurt and runner from Seidel to Dave DeLorean. He has DeLorean reeling on the run, maybe. Uh -oh. Up and over. DeLorean sends him out. Seidel connects that big forearm. He's going to springboard in again. Oh, and a springboard cross body. Cross Dave body. DeLorean, he rolls through. Hey, hey wait, grabbing, is that hey, tight? He's, he's got tight. Oh, referee. come on. The referee did not see that, but that was plain as obvious, clear as day. That day Dorian was pulling the truck. Oh, high risk. That cross body worked against him, rolled through, and then a handful of tights. Your winner, one half of the Black Hand Warriors, Dave DeLorean. Fans, we'll be right back. <laughs> 